and we are here with Richard Maidley, another person. There's a few people that I've seen today and yeah. I get really like a little bit starstruck because I've grown up watching you. <laughs> And what you're saying is I'm very old. No, but this That's is fine. the thing. It's not. And then Ross Kemp said that. And I was like, no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying it brings my childhood back and it makes me feel like, you know, special. Yeah. And I feel like I'm, a, I'm with the big dogs. Well, I guess because Richard, because Richard and Judy, or as it, as it started this morning, you know, on ITV, it was the first kind of daytime show of its kind. Right. Uh, and it attracted people who never normally watched television at that time of day before, you know. So we had students watching yeah. we had kids off school sick watching and their mothers watching and all the rest of it people who were perhaps on shift work or didn't work at all watching uh, so yeah we kind of developed a whole new kind of family audience and they've grown up yeah and you're right. exactly yeah you're right. and you know people are, i'm not gonna ask how old you are but but a, a lot of people who kind of yeah get what we did and who we are um remember us from when they were quite small which does make you feel old uh, which is fine it should it should make you feel um celebrated right. and treasured okay, I'll that's do, what it should I'll be I'll write that down yes celebrated yes 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 okay. so it's been a big year for tv yeah. uh, what what's some of your like highlights this this year uh i'd say the way that the media got their got their hands around the covid story i think to begin with in terms of news coverage the media were like everybody they were mm. kind of thrown by what mm -hmm. was happening couldn't quite get a grip on it couldn't quite, couldn't quite understand what it was that they were reporting but i think the british media got got their heads around it quite quickly and I think that some of the reporting and some of the analysis of what was going on with the lockdowns and all the rest of it as the thing developed was 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 very very strong um, so I think I think the British media did a very good job actually covering the whole Covid thing given that it was unprecedented we'd never right, gone yeah. for anything like it before how weird is it though doesn't Covid feel like a long time ago Isn't I mean it? It, it's still here but it feels like a long time like well, what if, we were, if, if you and i've been standing here a year ago we'd probably be wearing masks well, wouldn't we and, and we'll be like and we'd be like that <laughs> and we'd be doing bumps yeah. and all the rest of it all of that is thank god all of that is going yeah, now yeah, yeah. because although obviously it's still an issue and you know it has to be taken seriously and you know, we all, all had to be tested haven't yeah, we you yeah, know yeah. before coming here today the fact is it has mutated in the way that it was predicted to mutate mm -hmm. and it is not as dangerous as it was i know for some people it still is but for the vast majority of people it's not much worse than a cold now so mm -hmm. we've come through it we're definitely on the other side of it no question so we've seen you, uh, seen you on our TVs a lot, doing a lot of, uh, like, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Rubbish. No, reality <laughs> world. You've been in the reality of Dynam, I'm a yeah. celeb, The yeah. Circle. So can we expect you to see you on The Voice? Because I want to see you on The Voice. Uh, I, I don't think I could carry that tune. <laughs> I don't think I would carry that tune. And also, yeah, I did The Circle, which I really enjoyed. Yeah. And I did I'm a Celebrity, which was enjoyable, but very, very, it was, it was, it was quite punishing I mean it was in this freezing castle in North Wales you know um, it, 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 it didn't have that kind of that kind of um, upmarket feel right. that the show from Australia does right. it was pretty grungy um, so I think I'll take a break from reality for a okay. while I think I've done my time on that fair enough but one last question if you could sit next to anybody tonight anybody who would it be oh well I wish it was my Judy uh, but she's completely backed out of television now uh, she's, uh, she's 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 done it been there, done that, and she's very happy not to be part of it. But it means I can't come with her to oh, stuff like this. Right. So if I could, it would be her. Oh, OK. Well, if she's at home watching, hiya, Judy. How are you? <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, Thank, you. To you. Thank you. Thank okay, you. Bye. Bye.